Did you know that you can use something like this to inject your hearing aids with steroids? Hey guys, Cliff Olson, Doctor of Audiology and founder of Applied Hearing Solutions in Phoenix, Arizona. And in this video, I'm talking about how to get maximum speech clarity from your hearing aids in background noise. One thing that you may not know about me is that before getting into audiology, I actually got my undergraduate degree in exercise science. The reason why the science behind exercise was so appealing to me is that I have always been interested in maximizing my own physical performance ever since my time in the Marine Corps. When it comes to fitness, doing pretty much any exercise can get you in better shape and improve your overall health. However, there are numerous things that you can do to maximize your overall physical fitness if you know what you're doing. Well, the same could be said when it comes to hearing aid performance and hearing better in background noise. Perhaps this is why audiology is so interesting to me, because just like exercise science and maximizing physical performance, audiology allows me to maximize hearing performance. And sometimes I recommend that people do things that not everybody else does to help them hear their best, especially when it comes to getting better speech clarity and noise. But before I explain exactly what these things are, do me a huge favor and click the like button. It really helps out the channel because it gets these videos in front of a broader audience. And while you're at it, if you have not yet hit that subscribe button with notification bell, go ahead and do that as well. It is greatly appreciated. And huge shout out to Phonak for sponsoring today's video, but more on them in a little bit. And let me know down in the comments section if you would be willing to do certain things that not everybody else does if it meant getting better clarity and noise. Okay, so if you have hearing loss and you treat your hearing loss with hearing aids, chances are you're going to have a significant improvement in your overall hearing ability. And this really does include both quiet situations and noisy situations. The reason why hearing aids work so well for the vast majority of individuals with hearing loss is that they restore audibility of sounds that are missing due to your hearing loss so you can hear them once again. And in some cases, just giving a minimal amount of amplification can significantly improve your hearing ability. This would be the equivalent of just starting to work out without having a clue of what you're doing or why you're doing it. Sure, you'll get in better shape, but you're not going to win any awards and you're not going to find yourself on the cover of a fitness magazine. If you really want to significantly improve your overall hearing ability, you need to make sure that your hearing care professional is performing real ear measurement when programming your hearing aids for you. Real ear measurement is a verification procedure that ensures your hearing aids are programmed properly to your hearing loss prescription to restore optimal audibility of the sounds you're missing due to your hearing loss. This results in a significant improvement in your ability to understand speech in quiet, appreciate music, and understand speech in background noise. This would be the hearing equivalent of hiring a personal trainer to ensure that you're working out correctly to maximize your overall fitness and prevent injury. Of course, another trick that you can use to significantly improve your ability to understand speech and background noise is to get better hearing aids. Hearing aids of today can run circles around hearing aids from just a few years ago. With the use of directional microphones, digital noise suppression, and even artificial intelligence, hearing aids are better than ever before at isolating in on the speech that you want to hear and reducing the background noises that you do not want to hear. And since we're on this fitness comparison, the fitness equivalent of getting better hearing aids would be you eating better foods and taking supplements to fuel your body. Let's face it, you can exercise all you want, but if you keep putting cheeseburgers and fries in your mouth, you are not going to achieve maximum fitness. The same is true when it comes to hearing. You can't use a low-grade device and expect to get crazy awesome results. Of course, when it comes to hearing your best, you can do all of the right things, but some people still want to get an unfair advantage when it comes to hearing better in background noise, and the hearing aid equivalent to a professional athlete taking a performance-enhancing drug is using the Roger On 3 from Phonak, today's video sponsor. The Phonak Roger On 3 provides an unfair advantage for nearly the entire Phonak hearing aid portfolio and even competitor hearing aids if getting better speech clarity and background noise is your number one goal. In case this is your first time hearing about the Roger On 3 from Phonak, let me explain a little bit about how it works. Essentially, it's a remote microphone that takes the voices of the people that you want to hear and it sends their voice directly into your hearing aids wirelessly. It significantly improves how well you hear in background noise by giving you up to 61% better speech understanding in group situations in loud environments compared to just using hearing aids alone. 
but it isn't just a typical remote microphone. It's a remote microphone on steroids because it gives you five different functions. You can use it in presenter mode where you actually clip it around the neck of the person that you want to hear. You can use it in pointing mode where you point it at the person that you want to hear. You can set it on the center of a table for it to pick up the voices of the people who are at that table with you without picking up all of the background noise around you. You can use it in headset mode where you actually plug it into your computer so you can stream Zoom calls directly into your ears and use this as the microphone to pick up your voice to go off to them. And you can use the included base station, plug that into the back of your TV and turn this into a TV streamer where you can stream the audio directly from your TV into your hearing aids without negatively impacting the sound for everyone else watching TV with you. But how is the Roger on 3 better than the previous versions of Roger? Well, there's actually three things. And the first thing is the receiver. Receivers. Why is this a big deal? Because the previous generation of Roger on devices either came with no receivers installed or only two receivers installed. This was a major problem because inevitably those receivers would get lost either with your hearing aids going back to Phonak for repair or just vanishing into the ether and you would be left with hearing aids that could no longer communicate with your old Roger on. Fortunately, Phonak was listening to our feedback because now the Roger on 3 has unlimited receivers inside of it, which means that you can never lose a receiver ever again. And it's not just the Roger On 3, it's the Roger Select 3 and the Roger Table Mic 3. Second, these receivers are O2 receivers, not O3 receivers, so they are equipped to function both at home and at schools. This is a great new feature, especially if you're still in school, because it allows you to seamlessly switch between different Roger devices, including the Roger touchscreen mic that is typically used in schools. And third, Phonak added a new wide pointing mode. Previously, the Roger On had a very narrow pickup range when you decided to point it at the person that you wanted to hear. The problem with that is, is that it would only isolate on that one person. But if you have two people in front of you that you want to hear both of them, you need to make sure that that beam of pickup is actually wider to pick up both of their voices. Now, inside of the My Roger Mic app that helps you control the function of your Roger On 3, you can set it to wide mode or you can keep it narrow depending on what your wants and needs are. And for an added little bit of benefit here, Phonak decided to do this upgrade on older versions of Roger On technology with a firmware update from your hearing care professional. If you want to learn more about the Roger On 3 or any of the other Roger devices in Phonax portfolio, I will have a review video linked in the description of this video. So hopefully this helps you understand why using remote microphones gives you an unfair advantage when it comes to hearing better and background noise, and it's roughly the equivalent of injecting your hearing aids with steroids. In fact, they work so well that there's data out there that suggests that you using a remote microphone with your hearing aids will help you outperform normal hearing individuals when it comes to background noise situations. Now that is crazy. No wonder why these accessories are becoming more popular than ever before. Fortunately, unlike performance enhancing drugs like steroids, it is completely legal to use these remote microphones to enhance your performance and noise. At the end of the day, there are a lot of different things that you can do to maximize your speech clarity when it comes to background noise. You can get better hearing aids with better features and customizations and artificial intelligence. You can find a hearing care professional who follows comprehensive audiologic best practices, which includes real ear measurement to ensure that your hearing aids are programmed correctly to your hearing loss prescription. And if you want to, you can cheat to gain an unfair advantage by using a remote microphone to help you hear significantly better in these background noise situations and just maybe better than someone else that you're with who has normal hearing.